Welcome to App Design Tips. This video is part of a free complete icon design tutorial. If you want to follow along, you can download the exercise files using the link in the description below. Now on to our chat icon. So let's zoom in here to our chat artboard. And the first thing we want is just a square. So I'll just make this a perfect square here, 80 by 80. And as soon as I do that, let me resize this to be somewhat rectangular, like a chat bubble. And I think somewhere right here, that probably looks good. And then I wanna round each of these corners. Let's go about eight pixels here. And then we want this chat bubble to have a tail. So what I can do is just draw a square, something like this. And then using my select tool, I can double click, remove this anchor point here, and now we have a nice triangle. And I'm gonna select these two anchor points, just move it down so it won't be a completely right angle. It'll have a little bit of an edge here. And let's just move this around. And the nice thing about this is we can already join these together. We can add a black fill, and then I can zoom out and see how this looks. And if I ever wanna change the way that that tail looks, I can move in here, change it around. But I think I'm liking something like this. So that's starting to look okay. And I actually want some circles inside of here. So I'm gonna create the first circle right here. And that's a little bit too large. So maybe I'll do a 12 by 12. That should look okay. And we'll make this four pixels away from each other and center these right on this square here. Now, because I have these three selected, I can hold down shift and select this chat bubble and we can subtract those circles, just punch a hole in them. And now you can see as I move them around, you can see that they are holes and not just white fields. So I'm gonna move this and center this right on the artboard and there's our little chat bubble. And already, I actually think those holes appear too big and they're a little bit close together. So I can still zoom in here and just double click inside of here, select these three ellipses here. And let's make these just eight by eight, center these in here, something like this. And now if I zoom out, I think that looks a little bit better and is better balanced. So again, the power of non-destructive editing, you can make some changes after you throw down the shapes. If you're enjoying this free icon design tutorial, I have a complete course on learning Adobe XD for UI UX design. You can find a link in the description below with a steep discount included for my YouTube fans. This course will cover everything from learning the Adobe XD interface to designing and prototyping an entire app from start to finish.